Hey yeah. So we had to go shopping. So this morning we went to and dropped Stormy off at preschool and then we um, dropped the car off at the mechanics because she has to get repairs done for registration or roadworthy here in Australia. And so we took that opportunity being in town really early in the morning, like 8.30 in the morning, and we had to go do some shopping for necessities, um, some essentials, a lot of needs, not necessarily essential, but needs, and some things just to make our lives a little bit more comfortable during this quarantine. So don't at me, okay, this is what we did. Um, there was hardly any people at the shopping centre and we observed social distancing rules in regards to everything. So, um, with that being said, this is what we did. Um, this is the haul of what we got to make our lives a little bit easier at the moment. And this, apart from groceries, will probably be the only shop we do until this is over. But it's starting to get cold here. And... Um, I'm low on jumpers or sweaters, cardigans, whatever you want to call them. I don't have many, um, mainly because I put on a whole heap of weight this week, this year, which I'm trying to lose, but at the moment I need something to keep me warm. So that being said, I brought this jumper. It's a cropped pink jumper. I have a mustard one that I brought the other day and I love them. Um, it was $15. Um, but they're really comfy. Um, I brought a long black cardigan, which is really soft and has buttons at the front. Um, really nice to feel. Um, that was $30. Um, I've had my eye on this for months. It is a light blue, short, hooded, fluffy dressing gown. My dressing gown is great for spring and autumn, not so great for winter. So this should be really good for winter. It is so darn fluffy. So cute! And so warm. Um, just chilling out. We brought this for Stormy for quarantine because she's getting bored of her toys and wants to make me tea all the time. So we brought her a tea set thing. Um, hopefully she'll enjoy it. Uh, back to clothes. I brought this cute little cardigan. It's a cropped cardigan. But again, really soft, really warm, and looks really good with these jeans. I brought these jeans when I brought the mustard jumper, and they are $6.50 and amazing. Probably won't last me very long, but they're good for now. By the way, this jack jumper was $25. So these are $6.50 jeans. Not, as I said, not great quality, don't expect them to last me ages. But they'll get me through winter. I brought... I cannot remember how much this was. I think it was $20. But I brought this blanket to go on our lounge. So that Stormy can cuddle up on it and so can me and Daddy. It's really soft. It's a blush pink. As you can probably see, I don't know. But it's really, really nice. Um... That's actually an Easter present that I don't want on the video. Um, we brought some marble adhesive for a project we're going to do during quarantine on our coffee table and our TV stand. So look forward to the video for that. I also brought a marble candle that smells really nice. And again, this was just a make life comfortable kind of thing. Not a necessity, but it was really nice. I brought these. These are OXS makeup blenders because on my entire uh, everyday makeup with cheap AWS makeup, 
I got called out by one of my best friends <laughs> saying, you don't put it on with your fingers, you put it on with a sponge. So I'm going to try these out. That wasn't what she sounded like either. She's, she's, has, does amazing makeup every day. Like, gorgeous makeup. Um, I, as I've said in a couple of videos, especially when it comes to makeup, I have really chapped lips at the moment. Really chapped lips, really dry skin here. Um, so I got some lip balms. Um, this is a lip tint, which has extra moisturiser. These are all $2. I have a treat, a Argan lip treatment of Argan oil. I have another lip tint so that I can still have a, like a, a, a bit of colour while it's moisturising. And I got a um, another balm and, and tint that contains shea butter. So hopefully with all of these I should get on top of this lip thing. Um, got a budget planner. Dirk and I struggle with our budget. Um, we struggle with how to do it. Not necessarily sticking to it. We're pretty good at that. Like, this was all budgeted for. This had money put away for savings for winter stuff. And for my makeup and stuff. Like, we budgeted for it. So, also, we got the two $750 payout each from Centrelink for the COVID thing. So, um, we had the money. Um, but... Every day, we need a visual thing, especially for Dirk, because of his Asperger's. He really likes things being visual that he can look at and go, okay, bang, 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 bang. So we have lists all over the house on planners and stuff, but we needed one for the budget that works. So we're going to try this. It was $3, I think. So if it doesn't work, it's only $3 and it's a pad of paper for Stormy to play on. Um, I got a new watch because my last watch Stormy hated and kept taking it off. So this is um, $7. It was down from 15 so less than half price. So I grabbed it. And it's really pretty. It's pink and rose gold. Come on, how more millennial can you get? Um, I had to get new bras. Now, I have not replaced my bras since I finished nursing. And that was in August last year. So I really, really needed some bras. So I went to Kmart and Big W and had a look. And I got the ones from Kmart. So there's, um, they're all $12, um, $10 and $9. So I am a big girl. So I got big bras. If you wanted to use this as a, a face mask for COVID, like it covers your whole face. Like, like it's not a, it's a all whole face. So I got a grey one, I got a grey lacy one, I got a blue lacy one, and I got a white one. So that should cover all I need for now. I did not spend a lot of money on bras, did not get sized, one, because the sizing place is shut, and two, I'm trying to lose weight. So I don't want to spend a lot of money on bras right now, but I need something to help me out, because at the moment I'm just wearing sports dress. Shut up! <laughs> I'm just wearing sports bras, and it's not working. That beep was the MBN thing. Still haven't got that fixed yet. So, something... Oh, I got a rose hip lip balm thing too. So, we'll see what happens. I'll, I'll let you know which one works. As a little treat for me to make me feel a bit better, because I'm going to be doing um, a black nail polish review on black nail polishes that you can get from Big W and Kmart. I got some hollow nail polish to go over the top because I love hollow. I got a new BB cream because if you watched my makeup, everyday look makeup with, with cheap makeup, um, the BB cream I brought from Aldi did not work. So this is the lightest one, actual BB Garnier name brand crap. Lightest one I could find, so hopefully this works. I have a problem with my handbags. They are massive. And one of them has the strap broke. They're normally across here. And both of them hurt my back. So I brought a new backpack bag. 
and a new wallet because my wallet was dying. The backpack was fifteen dollars, and the wallet was ten. No, nine, nine dollars. So hopefully that'll help my back when I go shopping and stuff once this is all over. I got a journal because I have been told by my psychologist that I should maybe be starting to write things down that upset me and get me anxious. And yes, I know there's like January 2019 calendar behind me. Don't, yeah. I just haven't gotten around to getting rid of it. I got some masks because I want to try these out and see if they're worth reviewing. Like, I just want to try them out because, um, as I said, very dry and yucky. So trying to get the moisture in. So I'm going to try these out. See if they're any good, and if they are, I'll recommend them, and maybe even do a review of them for you. I got some really pretty spray mist, because I am a mister. I'm not a perfume wearer, I, I'm, I have fragrance mist. So I have Violet Petal. I've got two others, and I'll let you know when I find them. So, we needed some boomerang pillows. Me and Dirk needed to replace our boomerang pillows. They were getting very uncomfortable to sleep on. And, um, so they were affecting our sleep. Um, so we brought two boomerang pillows, one each, to replace the ones that we've got. I brought, I saw this and I thought it was really cute, and so I brought it. I brought another candle with G on it for our last name. And it smells really good. comes in a really cute little box. Um, I brought some more makeup brushes because I'll be doing some reviews of makeup that I picked up today because I had to do some shopping for work as well, like for YouTube work, whatever. I got a little pencil case, marble and rose gold and pink to go into my handbag. So I always have some pencils on hand for Stormy. I also got some face wax strips because my moustache and my beard is coming back like a bitch. Pardon French. But it's really coming back and it's due for a wax and I can't go to the waxing salon or anything like that. Ah. So, here are the other two fragrances, so I'll let you know. I got So I got Violet Petal. I have another Violet Spray, which is really, really nice. Bellflower Lily. A magnolia lychee and they all last me for months Dirk brought me one for Christmas not this year that just went but the year before and I still got some left so they'll last me a long long time we got stormy a bed a double bed a couple months ago before all this happened and we wanted to get her something really nice to go on her bed so she got two brand new pillows to go with her brand new All Seasons quilt because we didn't have a double for her and Disney Princess um, quilt set now this was $50 down to 30 so I saved 20 bucks on this by waiting for a little while and also I think the shops are desperate for people to go inside while this COVID thing's happening got another candle that's pearlized just something pretty just something to keep me a little bit calmer because my anxiety has been playing up really bad um, so I have borderline personality disorder anxiety depression and I'm normally a homebody which is fine but having to be forced to stay at home and I'm sure I'm not the only one here. It gets a little... Mm, meh, stressful. So, my anxiety has been playing up. Which is one of the reasons I've got so many candles. Because I find that having a candle just before bed is really comforting for me. It may not be the same for everyone else, but for me it is. So I have lots of candles. I have lots of incense. I have a diffuser that d does um, oil. So that I have those smells that I find that are very comforting for me. And if you heard the back door, excuse that, that was my husband. Um, and I also got some cute little, um, again, not a necessity, but I saw these cute little 
earrings for sale for four dollars for each one and my best friend is going to kill me again because i got cheap jewelry well there's no way to get out the jewelry <laughs> and i saw these and i thought they were really cute and so that's our haul this will probably be the last haul for a good long time we got a lot of the things that we needed or like today um some things we didn't obviously but we took advantage of the fact that there was hardly any people in the shopping center and got some wants as well as some needs um as i said we probably won't be going shopping anytime soon except for groceries so they'll be probably the only hauls you see um i got some stuff some makeup um and nail polish to review over the next couple of weeks so look out for them on the channel um and until then subscribe if you like it share if you think someone can relate and press like down there that's all cool and if you have a comment concern issue anything like that stick it in the doobie doop and um and yeah we'll see you next time so bye that's it guys and i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you like it give it a thumbs up if you really really liked it subscribe and please continue to join us on our travels bye